We're coming up on the source of the distress beacon. Very good, Lieutenant. Right, Tenant. Bring up visuals as soon as we come out of electrical space. Aye, aye, Captain. Coming out of electrical space now. Ah! Status report. What's happening out there? It's been absolutely destroyed. There's hardly anything left. Wait. What's that? It's a rogue battery pack. The largest one I've ever seen. What's it doing? It's cycling, sourcing, then sinking current at will. That power supply isn't bi-directional. It's not equipped to handle the incoming current. It never stood a chance. That monster! We should fire now before it turns on us. No, Lieutenant. It's no monster. The battery pack is doing just what it does. Besides, we're inside a programmable, bi-directional DC power supply. We don't have weapons. Look! It's coming this way! Captain, what should we do? Let it come to us and prepare for energy recovery. It'll try to overload us! We've got a built-in regenerative electronic load. We can recover the energy it sends us at 96% efficiency, synchronizing to the ship's mains. We are bi-directional. I don't know what that means! It means that we can reduce energy consumption, generated heat, and carbon footprint. We are built for this. Right, Tenant? Status report. I don't believe it. We are recovering 96% of the energy it's sourcing from us. We are drawing less power from the ship's mains and now have enough fuel to get to the next episode. We're gonna be okay. He's letting us go. I was wrong, Captain. It wasn't a monster. It's just an application with demanding power needs. Not to worry, Lieutenant. These things happen when you're facing the universe's most extraordinary power applications. Now, onward into the test and measurement unknown. Aye, 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 aye Captain. Captain.